All right, thanks, Jamie. Well, happening now, Savannah leaders kicking off a series of meetings about changes to the city's alcohol ordinance that went into effect just this month. Flint Snyder breaks down some of those changes. Well, the city is meeting with managers and owners of businesses that serve alcohol. It's all in an effort to talk with those businesses about the potential impacts they could face after city council approved several changes to Savannah's alcohol ordinance earlier this year. City Council approved those changes back in January to bolster the licensing process and make the local ordinance agree with state law. Those changes include the creation of a committee to speed up the alcohol license application process and limit the size of pours and duration of tasting events. The changes also call for people who serve alcoholic beverages to obtain a server training permit card from the city. Today's public meeting is the first of several this week. You can see those dates and locations on your screen now. During his most recent news conference, Savannah Mayor Van Johnson said these changes could be impactful for many businesses, which is why there will be multiple meetings. We want to make sure that we're communicating well and efficiently and effectively what our um, our interested stakeholders, particularly our owners and management, about what those um, changes mean, uh, how do you comply, um, and make sure that they understand the implications of what was passed. If you want to see a full list of times for those meetings, just look for this story on our website. That's WTOC.com. Reporting in Savannah, Flint Snyder, WTOC News.